in terms of project-based learning, um, the, the, the challenge of it, I would say, is you give students um, a project to do, and whether it's in a pair or in a group, you give them some kind of task where it's the, the answer isn't just like an, a number, right? It's, it's something that's super complex. It takes time. You know, they have to make a plan. Things fail. They have to redo their plan. And so it, it takes a lot of thinking on your feet, using your hands, using the things we learn in class. Um, I would say one of the hallmarks of it is you plan something with the end in mind, uh, both the assessment and the project. And when you introduce it to the students, of course, they're overwhelmed and freaking out. Um, and then my job as the teacher then is to kind of help build those skills and lessons so that as they start completing the project, it becomes more and more doable, and it's not really a scary thing. So we're not just looking at recall and knowledge, but we're looking at it applied. We're looking at them to make evaluative decisions, analyze things, think about it in a, a big picture.